Okay, so we're here today uh, standing in front of the fermenter boxes. We're going to be taking out some cacao that's completely fermented now. I'm here with Melko and Jorge. Uh, these, these guys are part of the team. Um, so if you want to come in close, we're going to remove uh, the jute bag or the burlap sack that has been covering these beans while they ferment. And you'll remember when we first brought these in here, uh, they were very cool and they were white and they were still covered with um, that very sweet juice. Um, but now if you get a good look at the beans, you can see that they're very dark. As soon as you take off the jute bags and the burlap sack, a really strong smell of vinegar hits you in the face. Um, you can see Jorge making a face over here because the vinegar is hitting him. Um, he's putting a thermometer and we're going to take the temperature. Um, what we're trying to do is get these up around 50 degrees Celsius and uh, we can see 50. So it is up to 50 degrees Celsius. That's a good indicator that these beans are now uh, fully fermented. We've also been taking the pH every single day uh, which gives us another indicator. But these are ready to come out now and uh, move on on to the next stage of processing. Um, you can see what Jorge is doing here is he's measuring the temperature in various different spots just to make sure that um, every single bean in this box uh, is getting up to um, where it needs to be. So he measured the middle, he measured over here in the corner, and now he's measuring um, over there uh, in, the other, in the other corner. Cincuenta. Cincuenta. Tienen el palo? Okay, and uh, 50 degrees Celsius is uh, in the 120 degrees, right around 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, so what he's going to do to make it easier to, to scoop this out um, is he's got this um, oar-shaped stick. He's going to scrape the beans to loosen it up, and that's going to make it easier for Melko to put it in these big plastic buckets so we can carry it over to the, to the next stage of the processing. And so you can see he's an expert with the ore. He's really good at digging it in there and loosening it up. And by the way, just so you know, behind this box, he's standing on uh, like an elevated stand to make it easier for him to uh, get in there. So now he'll scoop it into these clean buckets. And uh, this is our, our modern technology. This is the way that we uh, move it on to the next stage. So throw this up on our shoulder and we're going to just walk it on over. <laughs> 